Now at 11, the countdown to the opening ceremony of this year's Travelers Championship is winding down. The 2019 player field includes more than 150 golfers. Hundreds of thousands of fans are projected to head to Cromwell during the week. And Channel 3 Shante Passmore is giving us a preview now of what we can expect for one of Connecticut's biggest sporting events. Shante? Yes, Kevin, preparations are coming to a close. Tomorrow will launch a week-long visit from world-class players, and the TPC River Highlands is rolling out the red carpet for them and fans. 365 days ago, Travelers Championship organizers already started planning for this year's tournament. It began when TPC River Highlands tore down its clubhouse to build a new multi-million dollar state-of-the-art facility. We got a first sneak peek of the upgrade through this exclusive tour. Talk about a bright, inviting space mixed in with a luxurious feel to eat and relax. And don't forget about that amazing view of the 18th when you dine at Grill 58. All of the tournament's preparations will be unveiled Monday when a who's who will be at this premier event to join in the opening ceremony, including Governor Ned Lamont at the first tee box. It'll be followed by the Aetna Tournament Players Pro-Am. This year's player field includes nine golfers who won the tournament, such as three-time winner and defending champion Bubba Watson, two-time winner Phil Mickelson, and Russell Knox. Leading to this week, Drone 3 has shown the TPC River Highlands a par 70, nearly 6,900 yard course, sharing tips along certain holes. The layout's an outdoor park essentially. It's a space golfers enjoy drawing large crowds for an exciting time. While Thursday's first round jump starts the main attraction, spectators can enjoy other sights. There's always a celebrity program, concert, and Women's Day events. And at last check, general admission tickets are still available. The Travelers Championship runs through Sunday, June 23rd. We'll have more information on the Channel 3 app. Live in the studio, Shantae Passmore, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, thank you, Shantae.